<laughs> Bella, you want to go down and splash around in the river for a little bit? You want to go do that? <laughs> We're, we'll go. We'll go in a second. We'll, we'll go in a second. I kind of forgot. I'm sure some of you kind of spotted this little. Uh, what is it? A canopy, a, a tarp, um, an awning. Yeah, that's it. A kind of a do-it-yourself homemade awning. And I picked. I mean, all this is from Amazon. Um, go figure, right? Um, I got a, a six by eight, just regular tarp. Um, eight feet that way, and six feet coming out. And I bought two a set of two telescoping tent poles. Okay, telescoping tent poles. I guess they are. And it came with the the paracords with the adjustable thing on it. Um, what else? So there's the tent poles that. Oh, and it's fastened with these magnets. Here, these magnets are also Amazon. Uh, these things are crazy strong. Okay, hang on. All right. Hang on a minute. All right, these are crazy strong. If you uh, just go to Amazon and look for, oops, and just look for, uh, search for magnetic hooks. Even though these aren't hooks, these are those. Come on, go through there. Um, I should start this all over, huh? Okay. So they're actually these uh, clasps. I forget what you call these now, but they're they're spring loaded. To, okay, so I just put those on the the eye of the uh, tarp, and 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 these things they just it, it's just crazy how strong they are. Oh yeah, there's two of them. <laughs> there's two of them on the on the side of the van. Uh, what I did initially, I put it on this. I put the magnets up on the the frame I built for the my solar. And I mean, primarily this is just a sunshade, uh, but it did start raining earlier. So I plopped them all down. I, you know, I took them off that bar and I plopped them all down right onto the van roof itself. So that closed this gap because, you know, some rain was coming through here by the door. So I just moved them all down and uh, that fixed that problem. But, you know, this tarp will never be, it's not like an RV type. This will never have enough slope, okay, to, uh, for water to run off it properly it'll always want to pull um so you know even up there it, it, it's, still, it's still not front off so i'm not going to intend for it to block rain i'm not going to expect it to block rain and not uh you know puddle here <laughs> so i just went ahead and i put a hole in it okay and that's okay it, it collects air and drains i could i could collect rainwater in a bucket <laughs> so, you know, in this piece here, and I, I got this curtain rod too. Same thing, Amazon. This is big long curtain rod, and I could fix this up a little bit uh, better. The first time I ever had it up, I'm gonna do some adjustments. I'll probably put a fold this around here. I can put a clamp or a, a clip, a clamp or a zip tie or a bungee or something, and and uh, better do that. But, uh, that's it. That's my do-it-yourself uh, awning. You know the way, don't you? Wait, wait, wait. Come here. Wait, wait. Ah, better come. Better come. There you go. There you go. She's, yeah, she's not much for swimming. She can, but... That's about it. Shoulder, shoulder height, she's she's good there. I don't know what, I don't know what used to be here. Look at the, 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 the cut stone here. This is probably old, an old kayak launch or something. This is how long this park has been here. You know, these big stones are the pathway down here. And, uh, these rocks and these submerged. They actually, I don't know if they're... They almost look like railroad ties, but if it was wood, they would they would eventually come up, come to the surface and floated. It's got to be a long cut stone or concrete. So maybe some kind of I don't I don't know if there was a dock out here. Oh, look at her go! Are you swimming? 
Wow. Did you take a little swim? You, got, you found a little deep spot there. Yeah, there's a couple more of those out in there. I can't see them from the reflection. Some other stuff. There might have been a little launching dock of some sort here. Look at you. Look at you how far up you are wet. That's that's rare. Huh? Actually go swimming. Go on, go swim. Take another swim. Once in a while she'll once in a while she'll swim going that deep. That's that's really her limit. I'm surprised she here we go. Little deep spot. You gonna do it? Come on, swim across. Ah, you can still touch bottom. <laughs> Look at you go. Shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off. Look, this one. Ready? We need, to, we need to throw a stick. <laughs> we need to throw a stick, girl. Oh, is this water warm? Wow. Nice. Nice. Come on, better come. Oh, that's definitely deep there. Oh no, <laughs> she's really in the deep. That is the deep stuff there. Look at, come on, turn around, come this way. Get her, come on, come on, come on this way. She says, I'm, I'm scared, I'm swimming for my life. Come on, girl. <laughs> wow. That's probably a new record. That's probably a new record. It's in the current yet. And it gets dark. It gets dark and deep right here. It's a, I'm glad she turned around. She might got over there to the other shallows and then been scared to, like, I don't know if I want to come across. Uh, she would have walked. We could have got her across the shallows over there. <laughs> what did you do? That was crazy swimming for you. Huh? That was crazy swimming for you, girl. She says, I'm done. That's it. That's I've had enough of that. <laughs> She's like, I may never do that again. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> this way. Ready? Ready? Better come. This way. Come on, girl. Was that refreshing? Come on, this way. Come on, come on, this way. Huh? Was that refreshing, girl? <laughs> now you can stay out of the van for a while. Okay? Go see Russ. I know Russ's uh, screen door is shut, so she can't go in there. We're good. What crazy weather. It's just weird having scattered thunderstorms. You know, they just kind of move in the area and then they move out. So we've had it off and on. It's been off and on. Yeah, it's kind of the way it is this time of year. Little drinks now and again to keep things green and growing and dust free. I'm like that nasty uh, desert, you know. <laughs> just a little jab to my friends, that's all. Oh, so yeah, we're fast forwarding here. Uh, chicken tenderloins tonight. Probably some uh, mashed potatoes. Uh, that's the main. That's the main things. Don't those look good? I marinated those in taco seasoning. <laughs> so we're having a kind of a maybe a Tex-Mex type of thing. That's what's for dinner tonight. We're gonna be wrapping up our stay here. This is our last night here. 
Uh, guess these things wrapped up and put away. Uh, maybe a little bit this evening. Finish it up tomorrow. And we're gonna go check out the next. See if we can find the, the next cool place in the Allegheny National Forest. All right, the thunderstorms moving this way. That's why we went ahead and cooked the chicken ahead of time. We're gonna. <laughs> so the chicken is done. And we just been hearing some thundering and lightning and you know. Here comes another round. This awning thing is working out so good. There is no water coming down there. It's so nice to be able to have the van doors open and uh and just be able to sit here and still get fresh air and the view and uh not rain be coming in these doors. So yeah, I can just uh I can sit here or I can put my get uh, go over and get my lawn chair <laughs> and sit out here and there's no rain. It's 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 doing its job. It's 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 not perfect, but I'm quite happy with it. This is so nice to sit here during a little rainstorm. Oh, there goes some water. Okay. <laughs> there is it. Yeah. Um, I actually washed those. I actually washed my dishes a little bit ago when it was raining a little bit harder. I had a steadier stream. It was actually coming through my hole. Hang on. Where is the hole? Right. <laughs> That's the first for me. I actually washed a couple of pots and pans with rainwater. I've never done that before. I maybe collected rainwater in a bucket. Um, I don't know. Um, it's just nice, so nice to be out here with the van and be able to do this. Ah. And Bella, we were still sitting when it first started raining for a bit. It's coming down. A little bit of wind. Nothing too bad. Uh, Bella says the heck with this. Bella come over. Jumped in the van. She got up in her front seat, the passenger seat up there, and she's up there hanging out. She says, I don't know about you guys, but I'm going in. I got some sense. <laughs> Bella's the smart one in the group. 